Chaos at the Winona Peach Festival last night as police disperse a crowd using pepper spray. Police say officers likely prevented a shooting. That the actions of these officers that night at the Winona Peach Festival, they uh, stopped what could have been a a tragedy at a festival uh, that involved thousands of community members. Why would anybody bring a firearm to a festival? We have to work together, we have to share information, we have to be one in creating some semblance of public um, order and public safety. Good evening, thank you very much for joining us. This isn't the only violent incident being investigated by police today. A man was also attacked at the festival. Well, five people were injured in two other separate shootings. Taking a look at where the violence occurred, one of the shootings happened at Club 33 on Bowen Street in the downtown core, the other at Petals Tavern at Barton Street East. Meanwhile, police likely prevented another shooting at the Winona Peach Festival. And also at the festival, a man was attacked with a baseball bat in the parking lot. Lot. All right, there's a lot to cover. Please held a press conference to talk about it all today. Julie Sharp breaks it all down. The first incident took place around 9.20 last night at the Winona Peach Festival. Hamilton police say they observed a disturbance between two males. People who were there told police the suspect had a gun. 23-year-old male was arrested and found to be in possession of a firearm uh, with a high-capacity magazine and ammunition. He faces numerous charges, including uh, possessing a loaded firearm and uh, possessing a prohibited weapon. An unverified video surfaced on social media appearing to show officers spraying a substance. According to police, OC spray was used on individuals that were in the way of police making the arrest. Our officers were attempting to gain compliance and giving directions to those, officer, uh, to those uh, members of the community to back away from the area to create a safe space for us. Uh, they weren't uh, um, abiding by those directions and that caused our officers to, yes, use uh, our OC spray and uh, batons to gain uh, some space for our officers to complete their duties. About an hour later, police were called to a parking lot close to the Peach Festival. A 53-year-old man was attacked by four males with a baseball bat. It was just a neighbor in the area, so I believe there was a disturbance that was occurring in, in the parking lot that bled into their private property. I think there was an interjection by the, the resident, and then they became a victim of an assault. Later on, just before midnight, police were called to the parking lot of Petals Tavern on Barton Street East. Two males, 120 and 28 years old, were found with injuries but are expected to be okay. Both of these victims have been uncooperative uh, with us and our investigators at this time. Uh, they, we, have, we do not have many details related to that shooting. The suspect is described as a black man in his 20s with dreadlocks and a ponytail. Police say he was last seen wearing dark clothes and a hoodie. Earlier this morning around 6 a.m., police responded to another shooting at Club 33 on Bowen Street. Three people were found shot. Three individuals in their, in their 20s sustained serious gunshot injuries. There was a dispute, there was an argument that was occurring in the parking lot area, and then that's when the fire, uh, the, the shooting occurred. Two males and one female was transported to the hospital. We're looking for a male white with blonde hair, a light beard, wearing a black Blue Jays baseball hat, wearing a white shirt and black jeans, and he was last seen leaving in a gray sedan. 